Welcome back. The Junkanoo world will now be governed by a newly formed corporation on Grand Bahama. This announcement coming from members of the corporation and also the minister responsible for youth, sports and culture. The Grand Bahama Junkanoo Corporation will be merged from the Junkanoo Corporation in New Providence and that will consist of a group of leaders throughout Grand Bahama. Our Azure Quant was there for the launch and filed this report. Well, there's a new corporation in town that will be spearheading the New Year's Day John Canoe Parade. The announcement being made here at the Grand Bahama Sports Complex by the Minister of Youth, Sports and Culture, the Honorable Mario Boleg, noting that the Grand Bahama John Canoe Corporation, consisting of group leaders throughout the island, will now govern the New Year's Day John Canoe Parades. John Canoe leaders throughout Grand Bahama are uniting together under the newly formed Grand Bahama John Canoe Corporation, which was established for the different groups to be more united. Just days after the 2023 New Year's Day Junk New Parade, it is being launched as a legal binding corporation with total control over the governance of the parades. We are here just to let Grand Bahama know that we are basically speaking on one voice and so therefore, you know, we are able to provide a better quality product and do a lot of new things coming for going forward and in the future. The Minister of Youth, Sports and Culture, it's the nice Honorable Mario Boleg, in, uh, also on hand for the launch, years. lending his full support to the newly formed corporation. As a corporation, united, they can get more support. And that's what we want to do, for the greater good and development of Junkanoo and Grand Bahama. It's very much important that the Junkanoos be one corporation in order to obtain uh, major uh, support from the uh, corporate world. The Junkanoo minister further stating that his ministry would continue to be in charge of the logistics and management of all parades in the Bahamas. But in addition to that, there will also be a parade management team made up of prominent community members with experience organizing parades, who will collaborate closely with the ministry and corporation to oversee and support the implementation of the rules and regulations that have been put in place by the groups. Most of the persons who the Junkanoos have the greatest respect for and trust, uh, and, and that's persons like uh, Sean and Allison and many others who they've seen in the past uh, help manage the parade, who have the experience and also know John Canoe very well, uh, along with uh, members from the ministry, uh, Ms. Leary and Norris Bain and others. But, you know, uh, at the end of the day, the parade management team will be a team that the John Canoes feel comfortable with that will not be any bias, but be true to the fact and ensure that their rules and regulations that governs the braid is seen true to the T. Now the next parade the corporation say they look forward to will be the 50th Independent Celebration in July. For the Bahamas Tonight, the Northern Edition, I'm Azure Quant.